Uh, I guess we'll just wait here. Is that what we're gonna do? All right, Daniel, what does it say? Well, it seems to follow suit with many of the religions I've studied. They tend to weave their doctrines into simple fable-like narratives with characters that are meant to be identifiable with a common individual. Well, why don't you read one to me? I love a good yawn. They all seem to teach meditation on one's worth and significance, the path of righteousness towards a, a state of higher being. What? I'm sobbing. The central icon of the religion seems to be fire. I don't need a book to tell me that. I mean, that would make sense. Fire is light, energy, warmth. And yet, on Earth at some point, fire became associated with demonic imagery. Things that are evil, hell, not heaven. And? I'm just wondering if the ancients had something to do with that. Tell you what, why don't you flip to the end and see how it all turns out? Hmm? Um, sorry to interrupt, but, um, if you brought us here to try and convert us, I think it's fair to tell you that we're really not in the market for new gods. Come with me. Could you not have asked that an hour ago? I've been listening to him drone on and Not on. you. What? Not who? Not me? But I... Uh, I'll wait here. What's going on? This is bad. Worse than being burned to death? It appears our ascended ancients and the Ori have a slight difference of opinion. See, the Ori seem to think that because they're ascended, human beings should worship them. All humans. And if we don't? Then we're unworthy of living and should be destroyed. I don't think enlightenment means what they think it means. See, apparently our ascended ancients have been shielding our existence from the Ori. They've been protecting us. The Ori seem to think that our ancients are evil because they haven't shared the secrets of the universe with us. Well, I hate secrets, at least the ones I don't know. See, the problem is the Ori now know our galaxy is inhabited by humans because of us. I refuse to accept the blame for that. Curiosity is part of human nature. Look, if the ancients knew that the Ori was so bad, why didn't they stop us from coming here? Free will. Right. If they have been protecting us, there's no reason to believe they won't continue. The ancients may be protecting us from the Ori, but not their human followers. See, ancients won't interfere in any lower planes of existence. If anybody from our galaxy wants to worship the Ori, apparently that's our choice. And they won't stop priors from coming through the gate because apparently they've already sent one. The Ori have given Pryor special powers, and that's not fair. They're still human. And highly evolved humans can have some pretty amazing abilities. They're using the secrets of the universe that the Ori have given them to spread word of the Ori's godliness. And when people don't see the light, it's going to be... What are we going to do? I don't know. I'm starting to think that sending Pryors is just the beginning. We could be talking crusade here. We need to warn Earth. We need to get out of these people. The Ori are great! I love the all right. I'm a believer. What's the matter with you people? I'm telling you, I've seen the light. I don't think they're buying it. Well, I've heard you do better. Oh. Second time's the charm. Thank you.